I think networking for young people um, is, is really important, but I've had experience, and you might have too, and I think we all have, of people who don't know how to network in a responsible way, meaning they just come up to you and say, can you do this for me? Right, right. And what advice would you give uh, young artists about approaching either a composer or someone you'd like to play with? Mm -hmm. Don't be obnoxious. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there are some people that you see them and you sort of make your way towards the door because you know that they're going to pin you against the wall and say, I've just done this, I've just done that, you know, and they're going to give you their whole resume. That is obnoxious. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, realize that people are busy. As a, you know, as a young person, you've got your focus and, you know, you want this performer to do this piece. But realize people actually do have other things to do than talk to you. <laughs> And, right, <laughs> and just be respectful of their time and what they're doing, and also to do your homework. If you have a particular performer in mind, check out their website, find out what they're doing in the next, um, you know, couple of weeks. Go to their concerts, get to know them, so that when you approach them, you say, "I know you've done X, Y, and Z. Um, would you be interested in this?" And of course, emailing somebody is usually better than coming up after a concert when somebody just is, all they want to do is go out and eat. Right. <laughs> so it's a difficult time. Timing is very, very important. And as I say, not trying to throw everything uh, uh, that you've done at somebody um, because it's just like, you know, this tidal wave coming towards you and you just can't separate any of it. So like, be discreet and just one piece of information and do your homework. That initial contact, I think, after the performance is that really is fine. helpful. Yeah. Just saying, I loved your performance, and then emailing them afterwards. I think that's, exactly. that's, that's really important, putting a face to the email. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> as long as you leave right after, right? <laughs> and, and the subject of an email is also important, mm -hmm. you know, because um, if you have a big, long line of everything that you wanted to say in your email in your subject line, it's just going to go immediately into the trash.